Alright. Hey guys. So, um, went to Ulta today, and I bought this Chroma, um, the Kardashian, Courtney Kim, Chloe, Chroma Beauty, this line, um, and bought a lip set. It's the lipstick, lip liner, lip gloss set. Um, this one, I don't know if they're all, all natural. It says, I don't know if you're able to see that because of where. But up here it says all natural. And then the lid it says in the flesh. I think in the flesh is the color of this. If you look at the tops of the packaging, there's this spot that has like a color, and then there's this spot that's white. Um, I think they're all all natural, and then all natural, and then over here, this spot I think is the color on all of them. Sorry. Um, it was at my Ulta. Let me find it. It was $14.99. I honestly didn't think it was that much when I bought it. Oh. I thought, okay, honestly, I went in there. I bought like, I think I bought like five or six things. And I was expecting my total to be like around $50, $70, something like that. It was like $39. That wasn't even that bad. So this was like half of my uh, purchase. So that's not bad. But anyway, so I have it on my lips right now. I got home and I was curious, so I put it on. Um, I'll take it out of the packaging and show it to you guys. And then I'll show you how I applied it. Um, so a little thing slides out. Sorry, there's a really bright glare in here today, guys. Um, this little thing slides out and it has this in it, which it has two ends. It has... Um, the end that has the smaller side and then the end that has the larger side so it's the uh, lip liner and the lipstick so then those are on it and then the other thing in the package is the lip gloss and it's a really long applicator so you're probably going to be able to get all of the product out all the way to the end. But it's just a regular um sofa applicator. And this lip gloss guys. Oh my god. It smells it smells like lip gloss, but it tastes so good. Like everything I guess mixed together, it tastes just like really sweet. It tastes almost like a cake or an icing. So this is the color that it is and actually on the back of the packaging, there's um, a set of lips, and there's a set of lips on every single set of packaging, and it tells you the color that the products are together, and honestly, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's really close to the color. So, I'm going to get closer and swatch some of these for you guys. First, I'll swatch the liner side. They're just um, twistable thing. So I'll swatch this for you guys. Okay, this liner breaks really easy. That's the only thing I don't like about it. So, this is the liner. Kind of like a, um, kind of mauve tone. And then the other side is the lipstick side. And I even just broke that. I guess you just have to be really careful with these, and don't, I would suggest not twisting them up very far, really at all. So, that's the, um, liner, and then this is the lipstick, and I'll just really quick swatch the lip gloss for you guys. Alright, so then, up here is the lip gloss. So pretty much as you move down the hand, down the swatches, they just keep getting lighter. So I'm going to take a, oof, I'll throw it across the room first. I'm going to take a makeup wipe. And I'll take everything off of my lip. And you can see these, the color that I chose, is 
pretty close to my natural lips. It's a little bit lighter and a little bit more brown tone. Oh, and this liner, guys, just had to scrub off my hand. So it stays pretty well. Alright, so that's how I put it on. I just put the lip liner like how you would do any regular lip liner. Like, you see, it just broke off because I twisted it up after I started applying. Like, really? You can't. I don't know if it's just mine is really dry or if it's because it's really hot out today. But, um, yeah, I just broke like half of it when I was just trying to apply it and show you guys and stuff. So then do the other side and just fill it in. And you can see with the lipstick it begins to add a little bit of a sheen. Like over here I don't have any lipstick on, I just have the liner. And then over here and my bottom lip I have the lipstick on. So you can tell where it's on, where it isn't on. So this is just lip liner and lipstick. And it's really pretty and honestly you could leave it like this and just make sure lips look a little bit fuller. And it's a really pretty color. They had two other colors at my store. I'm not sure if they have more than three colors of these lip sets or not but there were two other colors in my store one was kind of like this it was a little bit more brown this one's a little bit more of a pinky nude and then there was one that was a much darker brown now i'm just going to do the lip gloss um i think the color of this set is in the flesh so that's what it says you're not going to be able to see but that's what it says on the bottom of the uh, lip gloss that comes with it so then Add your gloss. And you can see just from the top and bottom, the gloss just adds so much shine to the lip. So then just add it to the top. It's, it's like, it has, I already mentioned this, but it has like this, um, taste, smell, aroma thing going on, and it's, I don't know, it just tastes good. It tastes like something familiar to me, like, um, I've had another lip gloss like this or something, I don't know, but it tastes and smells really good. So, all in all, the Chroma, um, All Natural, their lip products, I love them, they're, well, I don't I wouldn't say I love them, but I do like them. They give really good color. They give really good texture. Like, it's nice and smooth once they actually apply to your lips. The only thing I don't like is the pencils are really easy to break. The lip liner is really dry feeling, so it broke really easy. Like, the first time I went to apply, I swiped like twice and then on the way back it broke and you saw like I was swatching on my hand it broke and even the lipstick broke but I admittedly did have a lot out on the lipstick side when that happened but the lipstick's nice and smooth it goes on so soft the lip liner does go on very well you just have to make sure you don't ret like um, retract it out too much and this lip gloss is awesome this lip gloss is something that I would probably even wear on its own. Obviously I'm going to have to if I keep breaking this and lose it all, but um, the lip gloss is really nice as well. So I think on a scale of 1 to 5, 1 being I hate it and 5 being it's the best thing ever, I would give these Chroma um, lip products probably like a 3.5 or a 4. They're really nice, just this kind of got me. Alright.
So, see you guys later. Bye.